Hello everyone, it's Karina. For today's video, I have a unboxing. This is an order I did on scrapbook.com. Originally, I wasn't thinking of getting the Woodland Grove uh, Maggie Holmes collection, but I did see the stickers and some other things when I was shopping at Joann's. When I saw it in person, I thought the collection was so pretty. So I went ahead and bought some things there and then ordered the rest online. But I was not able to get the ephemera, but I thought maybe I could, worst case scenario, if I can't get any of the ephemera, I can just get the digital collection. Um, I did get three of their stickers, the 6x12 stickers. And yeah, when I saw it in person at Joann's, I thought it was really pretty collection. And... I just absolutely fell in love with it so I'm glad I was able to find a few of the things there and they did have a sale when I went so everything was pretty cheap I also picked up the stamps the stamp set which I also fell in love with I can't wait to play with that and the last thing from Joann's I got the washi tape which is also very pretty. I love the butterflies. Alright, so now I'm gonna open my box and share with you guys what I picked up. Um, let me know what your favorite thing is about this collection. When I did my order, they had freebies. If your order was, I want to say, fifty dollars. Um, I don't, I don't know if they have the sale going on still, but this was free, and you can never go wrong with, with some plain cardstock. And I like the colors; they're very summery. And this was also free. It is um, some glitter, and it's like a shiny black these very thin glitters and there's different colors in there like i see some green red maybe some silver and some gold and so i got the paper pad and i just got one of these I already can't wait to start playing with this collection. whole thing there we go so here are the cut aparts look at these huge tags those are pretty this marble print which is also gorgeous I love that there's black in this collection love the flowers This one is one of my favorite pages. It reminds me of the Chasing Dreams frames. 
love this purple. This one's also one of my favorites. I'm mm, definitely going to be cutting these apart. I love that there's a mix of not so busy pattern papers. Perfect for layering. And get another cut apart. I love this one as well. There's a lot of pattern papers in this collection, is it? Hmm. This almost looks like this a little bit, but darker colors. These are lighter. Love this one. Look at this, so cute. I'm gonna have to get another paper pad because I don't see any repeats. Love this one. And this one as well. So I added these. I want to say this is one of my favorite pattern papers. This one. These flowers. Um, let's see. This one. This one. Those are probably my top favorites. But yeah, that's the paper pad. I got three of the foam stickers. And I have been seeing on some of the videos that I have been watching, um, they did mention that it is foam this time. So that was interesting. But yeah, these are really pretty. And I'll definitely be using like the foam for some layering some of the background foam try to use as much of it as I can yeah it feels very lightweight but it does have some thickness to it it's kind of hard to tell but yeah this is the chipboard of the puffy stickers these are really pretty I love how dainty they look as well I picked up the stamp and die set Can't wait to play with this. You guys, that frame die is gonna be so pretty. This is one of my favorite things from the collection so far. And I got three of the flower die cuts. And that's what it looks like on the back. So there's some gold 
gold pieces and there's some acetate pieces as well, these ones right here. I got another of the sticker sheets. So four total of those. And lastly, I picked up two of the journaling. Um, there's these things right here. I know the Parasol collection had these and I absolutely love them. So I picked up two. It's just perfect for layering. So yeah, you get 200 pieces in there, and I think they're, um, it comes with doubles. But yeah, I, I used these a lot uh, when I was playing with the parasol collection. Um, and yeah, that is everything that I picked up from scrapbook.com. I am on the hunt for the ephemera now. I will be getting the digital collection if it's not already out. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for some project shares once I get around to playing with this collection. And thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye everyone.